everyone, what's up? And welcome to La Trinidad. So we are here at Yangbu, Mount Yangbu, and uh, we got up really early today. Um, we were up before four, and we were out of the house. We were on the road at uh, around uh, four fifteen, and we picked up Fonzie, who is taking a picture over there, uh, having his picture taken by my wife. Uh, we picked up around four thirty, and we were on the road here. So it's a it's a quick 30 minute hike. Uh, we got here around 5 15 and uh, it was a quick 30 minute hike. But it's quite quite steep in some places, so it's uh it's it's challenging for people who don't normally hike. But it's a it's a really nice uh, view. It, it, we got here for sunrise and we were able to take a couple of pictures and uh, also had a couple of flights. Uh, unfortunately, Fonzie lost his GoPro session somewhere over over i think over there yeah over the, at those rocks by those rocks so over there with the horses uh those are some local kids yes kids they have horses they have their own horses and those uh, we asked uh some of those kids that you know if, if they ever find the session you know whenever they're here they can take a look at the grass and uh if they ever find it, well, we, we tried looking for it for uh, for a good 20-30 minutes. We even got got some leeches on our on our feet and our legs. Um, but yeah, um, if they ever find it, they can. We left our number with them, so they can give us a call. But yeah, it is a really, really good good spot. You can see over there is the uh, what do you call this? this? That's the strawberry farm. I was hoping to fly over from here, go over to the strawberry farm, but. Um, for some reason, I don't know, when, maybe yesterday when we were having our race practice, uh, must have knocked off uh, the, the GPS unit from my quad, and I just noticed it when I when we got here. Hello, now we're on GPS unit. Go. So, yeah, no long distance flights uh, for us. Uh, there's also a cell tower over there. So, uh, not quite sure if, uh, you know, uh, it, it did affect uh, somewhat our uh, VTX, uh, our video feed. So, it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit sketchy to fly over here. But, you know, crossfire was, uh, was all good except when you passed really near that, uh, that tower. So, it is a really nice place and I hope I can show you a little bit of uh, the footage uh, that we got here. And there they are. Say hi! <laughs> right, so we are about to head. Oh. Whoops! We are about to head back. <laughs> Whoops! Accidentally mooned, mooned them. But yeah, we're about to hike back after taking a few more photos. Yeah, we might be coming back here to do a couple more flights. Hopefully, with a GoPro. Hopefully, with a GoPro. Hopefully, we find or someone finds that GoPro and uh, yeah, we can do some really wicked flights over here. And for now, we'll probably just leave you with whatever flights that we were able to do this morning.
So it's been a few weeks since we, we went up to Mount Yangbu and lost that GoPro session. Uh, we haven't heard from any of the locals uh, about, uh, we, we haven't received any texts or anything. So it's either completely lost or completely, you know, uh, unsearchable or some, it, it might be still somewhere there, but, or it might have flown off the, the, the side of the mountain or it's also po a possibility that they've already sold that GoPro session on, uh, on the used market or you know, on the black market or wherever. But the good news is I found this good deal on Facebook and it is this, uh, this is the Armiton Rooster. It's, uh, it's already built with really nice motors. It has Sing uh, 4S uh, motors, 2450 kV. And I'll, I'll probably just sell this, sell this as well because the only reason I got this package was this. It came with this GoPro Session 4. It's in really good shape and even came with this <laughs> with this uh, what do you call this this TPU mount and I would recommend that you know uh, to use the TPU mount uh, in the future because uh, it's uh, it's more secured than the standard plastic hard plastic GoPro session mount so uh, we are going to go to Fonzie's house and he doesn't he, he knows I got the package he knows I, I, I that this this was sold to me and I bought it but he does know that I'm going to be sending this GoPro session for to him and I'm not going to give it to him for free. Of course, he has to pay me back, but he can pay me back whenever, you know. I'm quite sympathetic to the plight of students. When I was a student myself, uh, I really didn't have money, even when I started working. It took me a while to get to a place where I could say that, you know, I was comfortable with my finances. So let's go and surprise Fonzie. Okay, so we're at Fonzie's house and we're just waiting for someone to open the door. You just ran in the doorbell. Let's just wait. Looks like we were the one in for a surprise because he's not there. He's in La Union on a beach, but he'll be back tomorrow. So we'll try again. We'll try again tomorrow. All right, guys, take two. We're here at Fonzie's. Let's try this again. <laughs> Successful. Oh. Hello. Bursel. You get it? Ah, <laughs> puede. You get it? Oh. So you need to stay. Huh? stay. But to. GoPro, it's a session. <laughs> I know. Oh, it's not free. Pay me when you can. It's a good thing. It's a good first flight. Mo. All right, you're back up in the air. Five, five. Okay. So that is going to be it for this video. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's it. So after three weeks, since losing his GoPro, your dog's your dog's trying to get out of the gate. <laughs> uh, one is going to be back up in the air with a GoPro. That's yeah. going to be it for this video. Till next time, see you again. Bye.